Good afternoon. My name is James McElvain. I'm the police chief for the city of Vancouver. At approximately 11.30 a.m. today, a Vancouver Police Department traffic officer was shot during a traffic stop at Northeast 162nd Avenue, across of Northeast 34th Street. Officers and SWAT personnel responded to the area. The officer was transported to an area hospital and is in critical condition. I came home from lunch from work and I was in the backyard. I came home to let my dogs out and I'm in the backyard and I hear the gunshots. And I'm right, I mean, you can see where it happened. That's my house is the backyard there. So I walked out of the backyard, stood on the fence, and that's when I saw this lady in the Jetta. She pulled up and the officer was standing in the street and he was kind of, um, you know, he was, he was, uh, I don't want to say the word unstable, but he was kind of, so she was wrapping him up in, I, I don't know if it was a bandage or if it was something, she, a scarf that she had kind of around his arm and his neck. And he was uh, standing. Though. He was standing. She was standing next to him. She was kind of holding him up and wrapping him up. And when I saw this, that's when I, I <laughs> ran through the house around here, came back. I ran to them. Um, at that point, he was laying down on the ground, and she was next to him, kind of holding him. And and uh, and then I stood there, thinking, you know, again, you know. I, I wish I could have. I wish I, I could have done something, something better. I left the police scanner kind of avidly as a habit, and uh, knew this this gentleman here uh, pulled over someone right there on my road, and uh, I was like, oh, interesting. And then I hear the gunshots. You know, I knew it was the fireworks. Um, they were too shallow and too too. They were too controlled. You know, How many? Um, about seven or eight shots. Uh, the second to last shot ricocheted off a pole. I heard yeah, I heard it you know, ding off a pole, and uh, I knew right then that there was gunshots, and I'm like, what the heck happened? Didn't put two and two together until I hear the wreck, and actually, you know, that's when my intuition kicked in and said, oh my goodness, you know, this is possible. I'm gonna arrive at the scene and see something bad, and I did. At this time, two individuals are in custody and are being interviewed by detectives from the Major Crimes Unit. The regional Major Crimes team is continuing the investigation. No further information is available at this time.